This is Dr. Gary Salton, Chief of R&D and creator of IOP Technology. This video is a two-minute summary of the research on a sample of 4,280 engineers and 29,893 representatives from other professional areas. An earlier study on the engineering personality focused on professional engineers without supervisory responsibilities. It was able to explain why engineers chose a particular information processing strategy and showed that this strategy differed from those non-supervisory professionals in other areas. The current study is able to show that these differences extend to all levels in the managerial ranks. In other professions, the information processing strategy used to do the job changes with organizational rank. Engineers are different. Up to the Office of Engineering Vice President, engineers at all levels tend to use basically the same information processing strategy. This creates a very strong culture. The strategies employed within that culture are ideal for the engineering mission. The engineering strategy creates cars that start, buildings that stand, and players that grip. The engineering problem is managing the side effects of this optimal strategy. These side effects are both predictable and manageable. For example, simply considering consequence can have major effect. If a matter is of minor consequence, the engineer could be led to dismiss the issue using an expedient method. Little can be lost on a minor matter, time will be saved, and a decisive image will be created. There are many other such strategies that can be deployed and which will serve both the individual and the profession. The Vice President of Engineering is unique within the profession of engineering and they are unique among their peers. For example, their idea generating RI commitment exceeds these other VPs by 15%. The engineering VP needs this idea generating capacity to manage the variations generated by these other professions and to help engineering itself adapt to environmental forces. A key to satisfying these organizational responsibilities is for the VP to invest in knowledge of the soft skills that are often omitted in engineering education. Thank you for viewing this video. For more information on this research, you can view the 13-minute video on YouTube or read the research on Google Blogger, which is accessible from our homepage website at www.iop.com.